At some point, the walls and the paintings were so dark from decades of cigarette smoke, they had to clean them off, right? This is 24 karat gold leaf up here, right? You know what I'm saying? So they had to clean it. You're never going to guess what they used to clean it. I bet they... Wonder Bread. Wow. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> Wonder Bread. Yep. The only installation, public installation of this guy's work, and they use Wonder Bread. That's amazing. How do you know uh, so much about this place? Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, music is my life, bro. And this place, this is holy ground here. Everybody comes here. Yeah. You know, Bobby Short, George Fay, or Madonna. Bowie was living up here when he wrote Never Let Me Down. Really? Oh, man, I love that Prince album. was no here when that. he freaked out and recalled the Black Album <clears throat> the first time in 1987. Oh, yeah, that's the album he thought was evil, right? Yeah, it's like some kind of candy flip or something like that. And he thought the album was evil, literally. Yeah. Isn't that funny? It's crazy. Just said that. Hey, Eddie, one more round here, will you please? Sure. Yeah, I've, uh, I've met... Uh, I've met so many big stars here. Paul McCartney, Eartha Kitt. Mm. One time, sitting over here, right? Look over. In comes Mick Jagger, right? So I'm, I'm like, oh, go up to him. I have to, right? All I want to do is shake the guy's hand, right? Yeah. So he turns to me. I start crying, right? And what comes out of my mouth is, thank you for saving my life. Wow. Yeah. He looks at me and goes, you're welcome, man. Isn't that amazing? That's a flawless Jagger. Thanks. Paul McCartney, too, huh? Yeah. Met him. Yep. And Linda. They were sitting over here. They're drinking rum punch. <laughs> that's crazy. When was that? That was uh, 80, 80, 84. Because that's, uh, that's the year that Wings Over America came out. Please tell me that you know that album. Um, I don't know that album, but Rob here has a record. Uh, look, dude, you've got to check that album out. It is the best live recording of McCartney that's ever been done. You've got to check it out. Wings Over America was 1976, no? Oh. You a big Paul McCartney fan? Big enough to know when that album came out, which was 1976. No, sweet pea. You're wrong. You're talking about the Triple Live album, right? Now you got it. There you go. From the Wings Over the World Tour? Mm-hmm. Mostly from their show in L.A. that summer? Yeah. Yeah, that was 1976. Yeah, I love that album. I love it too, man. But, um, you know, I always want to take away points for all those vocal overdubs, you know? I mean, at what point is a live album not a live album, right? That being said, it has that sick version of Maybe I'm Amazed, which completely destroys the original, so I give it a pass for that. Oh. Thanks, Eddie. Mm -hmm. Got yourself quite a little firecracker there, don't you, Al? Yeah. Listen, a uh, <laughs> word of advice. It's all cute now, but uh, it gets old fast. Trust me. Jesus Christ. Jesus, what an asshole. That was like, that was like being a woman in a Michael Bay movie. What about her? Like, blink twice if you need help, right? Did not introduce her. At all. Nothing. What a dick. What a dick. Wow. Oh. What? I forgot to pee. Come on, you can pee in Noreen's. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about.